Hey guys, welcome to Factorio. Although, not just any Factorio. Today, I'm gonna do something called a Death World. But also, not, not just any Death World, actually. We're gonna set frequency to max, and we're gonna get the sizes of bases to max. Oh dear god, that looks absolutely terrible. I'm also just gonna set the starting area up a bit, because I need the extra help. And let me just randomize the seat a couple times. This could work. Oh, I think I can't do this. Ah, whatever. Let's just, let's just do it. Okay. So for those of you who don't know, Factorio is a pretty complicated game. Um, I mean, the goal is pretty straightforward. You've crash landed on an alien planet. Here, I'm picking up the ship. Um, and your goal is essentially just to get off. Uh, you can do it as quick as you po as po I mean, for me, I'm gonna have to get out of here as quick as possible because not only do you have to worry about finding different resources and making sure my factory is running properly, you need to worry about defending it from all these aliens. We can't see them right now, but they're around. Um, and just to say, I'm not great at Factorio. I would consider myself a good player. I have beat the game before. Um, never beat a deaf world like this. Um, so it's gonna be interesting. I think I'm probably gonna lose pretty quick. Um, the normal deaf world is hard enough, and adding the max settings that I did is really not gonna help me out too much. Early on, it's very important to get some of these big rocks around the map, just because they give you a lot of stone and hopefully, and sometimes coal as well. I don't know, I haven't done this before. This is my first attempt um, doing this deaf world, so I'm not an expert of like what to do first. I know I'm gonna need turrets as soon as possible, and I know getting these stones is a good idea. So let me let me just get all these rocks. Okay, got all my rocks. I think first things first, just to probably get a bunch of iron going, get some power going, make a bunch of semi-automatic uh, buildings, but definitely iron. Iron is priority, and then automating coal stuff is good as well. So how this game works, um, the more things you automate, the more pollution you get. So if you see this red, these red squares on the map, this is my pollution. If this pollution touches the alien bases, which is this little red part right here, they're gonna get angry and they're gonna come over here and try to eat me. But I don't want that to happen, so I'm just gonna hope for the best. Keep getting more rocks. I need to come up with a plan. I got a plan while I'm working. I think getting power is a good idea. Switching over to electric miners quick, so I don't have to have that much pollution. I think that's a good plan. Sally, the copper is kind of far from the rest of my factory, so that's going to be a little bit annoying to defend. Hopefully it's not going to be too bad though. Yeah, so first thing I want, I want to make a boiler and a steam engine. So that only takes iron. I also need the offshore, offshore pump. I need three copper. Let me just get this here before I head back. There we go. I think getting turrets and then coal production would be really ha handy. also want to put a little coal thing down here. If you take uh, two burner mining drills and then face them into each other on a coal patch, they'll just feed each other and then you'll get pretty much an, a fully automated system for getting coal. Another thing about this game, um, if you destroy your vehicles, the pollution will go away over time. Um, I don't think enemies expand unless there's pollution. I could be completely wrong with that though. We have enough for our first power system. So let me just get some more wood so I can get some power pulls. What I want to do is get power set up so I can get both a lab down and switch over to electric miners. Both of those are going to be very important. I definitely want to upgrade walls and turrets. Just everything here actually is going to be super important. I feel like everything I'm doing is just too slow. Okay, I got enough, got enough iron. Set this up. There we go. So this should just generate power for me. I'll bring it over here. I want to switch over to electric miners. Let's get rid of these. Stop causing unnecessary pollution. I'm still going to be causing pollution since the way my power is generated is from coal anyway. But it should be less. This here is just a little semi-automatic setup I know how to make. I believe the ratio for miners to furnaces is a 2 to 1 ratio. So... Hopefully that works pretty well. I'll do the exact same setup I have up top, except for the copper. Right now, the goal for this first episode of hopefully many episodes, this could be the first and last episode of this because I 
maxed out aliens everywhere. I mean, you don't if if you guys don't play Factorio, you don't you don't understand. I oh my god, I, I'm I'm freaking out right now. I'm trying to think. How many? How much iron do I have here? 400. Oh my god, what if I run out of iron here? What do I do? I didn't even think about that. I can maybe defend a base, but how am I supposed to get iron? Okay, I'm thinking too far ahead. I gotta start small. I gotta, uh, gotta think small. Uh, what's and now? I gotta think right now. Okay, gotta lab down. I don't have any science packs yet. Uh, I need to up my iron production before I can do much. Kinda have to move fast in the early game. Um, although I'm not really sure what I'm moving fast toward. I know I want more iron. And I think I want to automate walls as soon as I can as well. I don't think we're gonna have time or space for a main bus. Main bus is kind of the typical thing you do in Factorio. You just sort of um, bring all your materials into one location and have it go on like one long conveyor belt. And that sort of it takes up a lot of space, but it's a very organized uh, system for your factory. I think I'm gonna have to do a bunch of spaghetti, just make it so things work. I feel like I'm doing pretty well so far. Maybe I'll get a, a bigger smelting setup going. I don't know ratios for things. I think it's maybe 12. Could be 16. I'm just gonna get, get a bunch of furnaces. Oh, I need. Oh, I do have conveyor belts. Okay. So this isn't like um a very complex thing I'm about to do here. I am good at this game, I swear. Uh, I I just I'm, I'm very slow. Do this. Let's get a bunch more of these going. And let's get some science packs made up. So I want to start researching turrets and military. Oh no, this pollution is so big. If this pollution touches this right here. Oh, you know what's funny? I need a radar. I need a radar really bad. Let's get these guys put down. But now I need what I'm doing right now is I'm gonna set up a fully automatic setup for smelting. I'm gonna have the iron and the coal meet up on this side and then output the iron on top. I'm gonna put the radar up here, just kind of away from the factory. Radar counts as like a military target, so aliens, when they attack the base, will probably go for this first. So as a little... Just gonna be bait, pretty much. I'm also gonna get turrets right now. Um, turrets, walls, guns, all very important. Coal's gonna come in from the bottom, iron's coming in from the top. I just need inserters. I'll automatically smelt that. Having... Um, Fully automatic iron smelting would be very helpful. Uh, I, I don't know if I'm doing this right. This pollution is ginormous. As soon as turrets are done, I just gotta make sure I, I have something researching all the time. So I, I'm gonna queue up a lot of red science packs. Might as well grab some more copper. Well, I kinda got the free time. You guys might be, you guys might be thinking, what is this guy freaking all about? You know, nothing's happening. You know, hope you're right. Okay, there we go. Um, not quite done yet. I need some more power and some more inserters. The turrets are finished, awesome. I'm gonna set to automation next. I can start automating bullets. I don't have time to pay attention constantly to where the aliens are. So I just wanna get the turret down before I even need it. That's bad. We can't even see what's over here. I, I worry um, aliens could be right here in the void. We just can't see. I think things are going okay though. Um, if I can automate bullets, I think the next thing I'll do is automate walls, and then maybe even red packs at some point. Um, if I can just lock down my base, I think that's the the first order of business on a deaf world. No matter like what difficulty you're playing, like whether you're playing crazy like settings like me or normal deaf world, you just want to lock down your base with um, with turrets. Come on, craft! I need more conveyor belts. <sighs> oh my god! I almost. <laughs> I was just freaked out. I like zoomed out and the rocks looked like aliens for a second. Okay. Ah, okay, it happened again. Uh man, I'm getting scared about rocks. Not a good sign. I think I'm I think I'm losing it guys. Uh, okay, turret, you're gonna go right here. No power. Oh, I don't need coal. No power. Uh I should automate this as well. I even have enough power. Man, surprisingly. Okay, I'm <laughs> I'm about to this setup right here might break my power a little bit, but it's working for now. You get five bullets, because that's all I can afford. And then I will put that lined up. I don't know. Let's just do one more. I'm trying to set up a um, little area where I can automate uh, stones so I can automate walls as well. That's what I need next, automation. Okay, so as soon as, how many science packs do I have? 20. I might have enough, but let's get this iron going. Yeah, there we go. 
then eventually I'll have uh, another setup up here with another eight furnaces. I can put them down right now. I don't know proper ratios in this game. I feel like it's something I probably should know, but I don't. Okay, I should have enough science packs left over just to get automation. Where's automation? Oh, I already have automation. Walls then. Ah, that's right. I was just I was crafting uh, assembling machines while I was looking to automate. Okay, and then let's get you. Um, that should work. So what this is, it's gonna be an ammo factory. I'm just making bullets, and all the leftover iron will just be put in a chest for me to pick up afterwards. Um, I can maybe even add some more inserters, just to make that go a little bit quicker. Um, because bullets are gonna be vital. And up here, I'm gonna make a stone factory. That way I can automate walls. Because turrets and walls are gonna be perfect, and I need um, bullets to go in the turrets. So that's my plan. Project secure the factory. Oh, I need coal. Just grab some coal from here. Got tons of coal. I think my power is definitely gonna be struggling. So, I should probably add a second one of these once I get back down. Pollution is, oh my god. I don't know about this, guys. Why am I doing this? This is gonna be a one, a one episode series. Oh my god. I, I don't know. Like, I know how to play this game, but I don't know how to play it well. Oh, I, what am I doing here? Isn't it, guys? Okay, so at least we got we have walls automated, walls and bullets. So, neither is a, a fast factory, but they are fully automated. Now I think I 100% I, I need turrets everywhere. Turrets and walls. Let's use some more iron miners. But speeding up production isn't really the biggest issue for me right now. To be honest, it's hard enough to beat this game on normal difficulty, you know? Just with the automation, getting new resources, and the amount of time it takes. I think the amount of time this game's going to take is going to be a lot longer now that I'm doing a deaf world. Okay, so so far, pollution is absolutely terrible. It's going to hit the bases up here pretty soon. Looks like we're okay down here for now. Okay, I need to, I need to get turrets down, so give me some bullets. Okay, I need to put a turret at least um, guarding each part of the factory. So one here guarding the stone factory. I'll put another one guarding the ammo. Got one for the radar already. This isn't like um, a, a final setup for my turrets. I'm just doing this so there's some defense. I also think I need to add more power. Bring this up here. Ground. Once again, not a final setup. I can't say things are going good, but I can say they're not going terribly. I really gotta figure out a way to seal off some areas soon. The quicker I can seal off the, the different regions with semi-automatic um, like outposts, the better. Can't forget about this copper thing over here. Everything's kind of a mess. I'm not really worrying about organization at this point. Um, that might hurt me later on, but I, I don't really have time to worry about making things look nice. You know, I just gotta make it so it works. Okay, I think this should be good. Um, Maybe add more miners later, but as far as production for making bullets, this should be enough for a while. I think I need to make more mines just for the stone. Securing turrets and walls throughout the base should be my next step right now. I don't really have time to worry about research. You know what, I should probably make some sort of semi-automatic uh, thing for labs. Gotta put a chest for this guy. Get these down. As soon as the first attack comes in, it's gonna be like increasing exponentially from there. Oh my god, you can see on the map. Look at that. It's just a gigantic clump. Oh my god. Oh, I'm touching it. Okay, I need to, I need to like seal this area off like right now. New plan. I'm going to bring power up north. I'm going to build a wall. Hopefully I have enough iron for this project. I don't know if this is smart. Uh, I don't really have any tactics for death worlds. Okay, this is a pretty, this is a pretty nice choke point. I'm going to do conveyor belts all along this area with a wall over here. And I'm gonna put a chest filled with bullets and everything's gonna work out great. Aliens are gonna die, never gonna get through the wall, and I'm gonna beat Factoria. Okay, all my ammo. This should hold them, hopefully for a little bit, if they decide to attack, which I think they haven't started an attack force yet. The pollution probably hasn't gone far enough, but there was the first outpost I'm gonna need to Hopefully put another wall, probably two more here, one here, one here, 
and then a, a third one here. And then I don't know what I'm going to do about down here. This is kind of a mess. The closest cliffs I have are this far south. I could just wall off here, forget about the copper, but... Sounds good. If the copper was just like right here, that would have been perfect. The wall factory is doing well though. Once again, not pretty. Um, but I just need things to need things to work. I'm going to make a little setup here that crafts red science packs. Power, and we should all be set. Next thing we need to research. Um, this is always nice to have, just so I can get some more complicated buildings going. Maybe I should get like a a better smelting setup. Doesn't really matter right now. I think um, wall production. Is really for the best. Maybe I'll upgrade bullet damage, things like that. Okay, let me put a turret down there just in case they decide to attack. I want to automate turrets. What does it take to make those? Ah, uh, it's too complicated. Like at the moment, it's too complicated. I I just can't do it. You know, it's tough because uh, a normal factory, you're you're not in a rush, but I'm like I feel the time pressure, and I'm just not sure. Like I feel like I'm wasting my time by not doing anything. I, I need to figure out a plan. I guess maybe I should just craft turrets. Okay, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna craft turrets. That way I'm not wasting time. My power is still struggling. I need more miners down here. This game, like... The worst is when you solve one problem, and then three more pop up. Like, I know what's gonna happen. Everything seems to be going okay right now, but, like, I set up a wall thing, power dies, you know, I fix the power. I mean, it's... it's oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I wasn't ready. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. This is the one place I forgot to put turrets. Guys, I don't know about this. Of course I went for my power first. You know, in the oldies of Factory, aliens didn't used to be this smart. They just kind of did whatever. I don't know if this is a, a good setup. You know, at least I'm right by the power, so setting that part up isn't hard. Oh no! Uh... Oh god, there's another attack up here. I wasn't even paying attention. Okay, it didn't do a lot of damage. Um, so I'm still doing okay. You know, I, I can see myself making it to green science packs. I have absolutely no idea how I'm going to get to anything above green. I feel like I'm just going to be spending all my time rushing over. Um, and just like fixing things. There's got to be a lot of iron here. Oh, there is. Okay, I'm going to automate conveyor belts. I think as long as I can just seal off... Uh, the three places I mentioned before, over here and up here, I can spend my time doing maintenance in this area, and I don't have to worry as much about up here. Power, not have conveyor belts automated. Let me get a radar up there. A lot of walls, 164, okay. I'm gonna seal off this right side over here. Let me get a radar first, actually. I'm like, there's a lot happening. Uh, it's a little bit hard for me to explain what my plan is. Okay, yeah. Right now, build a wall right here, but I want to put down a radar up here first, and I need more iron because I'm kind of out of command. No, I might have enough conveyor belts. Okay, only a few, few biters. Not the best wall, but it gets the job done. I'll start with the wall here. Go up here. Okay. I'll space them out as much as I can, so just in the range of the last one I placed, pretty much. And then... Pull conveyor belts. Maybe more iron. Coal, iron, conveyor belts, ammo, coal here. There's just like, I'm doing like three things at once. I mean, I'm, I'm like, there's three things I want to do. Okay, when I set up this wall, let's get that here. I'll just put 200. Let me use the hotbar for a second. Man, I think up north is definitely the best place to put my first wall. Jeez. Okay, and let's finish off this wall. This isn't foolproof, but for now, it should work. There we go. And maybe I'll put a radar here instead, so I can see both the, the top and the left part. There we go. Two walls secure. Two more to go. Lots of iron, though. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Yeah, I'm making more turrets. Okay, let's set up another wall then. Yeah, they're going to be coming from this base soon, too, so... Oh my god, this pollution is terrible. Oh my god. I, the, I, can't, even, I can't even attack this base. It's going to continuously send guys at me, and there's nothing I can do about it. Hopefully it still stays just like one guy at a time. Can't do anything against that. Jeez, okay. If you guys have any tips in about my scenario here, because I, I don't know what my best strat is. Oh, uh, oh. Uh.
Oh dear God. Do I have any? Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I needed more turrets on the wall. No. All broken. Stay away from my factory. Oh my God. Oh, this is where it starts. This is where it starts. Oh no. Why did I just do a normal derp at that world? <laughs> Why did I do this? Oh no, they're attacking. They're attacking here. I haven't even... Oh god. Oh no, they're breaking stuff. I didn't have time to fix that area. I don't have time just to put down a simple... Oh my god. Please help me, turret. Please help me. I need fish. I need, I need help. I don't have time to pick this up. Oh my god, look at that huge attack. Okay, let me, let me connect tower. I can't give up yet. I got, I'm, I'm gonna keep going until this factory is gone. Okay, that's connected. Get you here. Let's get some more of these guys. I am on the clock here. I need to head back to that wall that was destroyed as soon as I can. Okay, it's gonna take a little bit of time, but that should be set up for the most part. I need... I guess more turrets to be honest. Factory is doing well. Um, production is enough, I think. Okay, at least they didn't break the inserters. But clearly, one turret spaced this far apart is not going to be good enough. Okay, three walls built. What are these guys doing here? Wait, is that a... No, they're going to attack my copper. Okay, I'm... I'm, I'm turning off the factory. I don't know if this is going to help, but I I need to do something. They have a base right here. No, 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 that can't happen. No, no, that's, this has to go. I don't have time to be dealing with bases. I need to get back to the factory. Oh my god, they're attacking the wall. I can't even see what's going on. Please don't break the wall. Hey, leave me alone. I think... Shotguns are supposed to be better against the bases. I don't know if that's true. Okay. Well. At least that's a small victory. I turned off the power, so I'm hoping this pollution goes away. Just to give me a time to think. Because um, I just can't deal with this right now. I need time to at least repair the factory. Get these walls set up, and then I'll turn everything back online. What I might do is disconnect the main factory, but still power... Oh, no. Oh my god, look at them all. I hate that sound. That's the worst sound to hear. God, it's all... They're just... There's just too many. They broke everything. Oh, now they're attacking. Oh my god. The pollution going away at least? I think a little bit. It's it's slowly disappearing. Oh my god. Uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> what's the status? Okay. I should get a radar over there at least so I can see what's going on. This wall to the right is too big. Oh, uh, they're out of power. Of course they're out of power, because I turned off the power. How would they have power? Okay, that's it. No radars. I'm just going to connect up the walls to power. Yep, yep, yep. I'm coming. Yeah, so here's my plan. I'm going to connect the entire factory. Um... To the power supply, but like, I mean, I'm gonna connect only the walls to the power supply. Why aren't you running? That should have turned it on. I don't understand. Oh my god. Oh, I hate that sound. Oh no! Ah, I screw this wall. Oh my god. They're gonna get through. I turned off my power. What more do you guys want? How is this pollution so much? I turned off my power. I'm not even making anything. I don't know, guys. I think this was a mistake. You know when you like watch someone do something and it doesn't look that hard? 
and they think, oh, I can do that. They just keep coming. Could have sworn if you turned off your power pollution. I think it's slowly going away. I don't know what these guys are doing. Like, where are you going? Why is he running up there? I'm just gonna get killed. Well, this is a. Uh, I'm. I'm gonna. I'm gonna leave this here. Uh, this is um Factorio. Really a hard death world. Um, really fun game. Really fun game. Um, I would. Um, I wouldn't do this. Like, I don't. I don't know. I don't know why I did this. Oh, let me know if you guys <laughs> went up part two well <laughs> where I'll try again. I <laughs> uh, I don't I don't even want to see what happens if I turn my factory back on. I, I, the pollution is going away. Um, I might not give up, but I I think yeah this is this is too much for me. I think I might try again with normal Death World settings, but this is like a super Death World. It's just a bit too much for me. Oh dear God. I think, um, I think they're just gonna slowly eat away at the factory until there's nothing left. Yeah, um, I think this factory is, how should I put this? Well, it's screwed. I, there, yeah, there, there's, there's no hope for it. If you guys like Factorio, I'll try this again with some different settings. Leave some suggestions for anything for me to do. As you can see, hopefully you're able to see that I'm able to, I, you know, I, I know the like, I know how to do things in this game. I'm just a slow player. Death World is not my style, but um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like if you did. Uh, if you didn't, don't do anything. And let me know what I should do next.